and it gives the same protection, but gives you more breathability. That's that's the feature of the of these pants. Is you want to have them uh, flexible. Hey guys, welcome back. This video is about Beyond Riders riding pants. About three or four months ago, I got from Beyond Riders these pants, and I decided to go for a long-term review. I captured some of the uh, unboxing. You'll take a look at that. And then I took them to India and rode them locally. My friends out at uh, Beyond Riders, actually very, very pleased with the response uh, that people had to their product, to the, to the flannel. So they sent me out something really, really cool. Let me show you, I just got it. Let's go with the item. Beyond Riders. I think they send all their products with this uh, string bag, which is pretty cool. Now this is gonna be my second one. Okay, they have the active, this is the level two armor. These goes uh, in the knees and in the hips. The item itself, stickers, and that's about it. This time what they sent me, they told me in advance, they'll be sending me riding pants, riding jeans, denim. Unique to Beyond Riders is their use of Kevlar and protective material. I did speak with the rep. Wait a minute, Pico is driving me, he's, he wants to go out. What was nice about the previous, uh, the previous review I did to the flannel is that I had my own flannel over here. I don't have jeans, so I don't, Kevlar jeans, protective jeans. So this is gonna be my first pair. I'm gonna, you know, first impression, what I think, I'll try it on. I took 34 uh, waist, I'm a 34, 33 and my inseam is always uh, 30 to 32. So I got 34 by 32 on their website, Beyond Riders. You can see the fitting and sizing. Let's open it up. Black jeans. I can tell you they're very, very light, very thin. I was told that it's stretch, four directional stretch, which means this way, and that way, so it's stretch, and I'll try them on. What do you have here, five pockets? Yeah, they have two pockets, a coin, a change pocket, other side, one pocket, and two pockets in the back. They have their, their badge, Beyond Riders, obviously belt loops. Back part, and the front as well, covered with Kevlar, pieces of Kevlar in the impact areas, okay? This whole area. And the thighs, this area. And I see a place for inserts. I guess of the, there you go, the knee pads with the fused Velcro uh, positions. So you get it fitted right on your knee. This is the, the hip, yeah, hip protectors hip uh, placement. This is pretty cool. They have flectors, so if you at night fold your jeans, uh, you know, at the end, I always like to have my jeans a little bit like old school, you know, uh, f a little bit longer and then I fold it once. When you fold it once, you actually get this reflective garment. So a little bit additional uh, visibility at night. The Kevlar part is the yellow, is the yellow part right here. And that's in the impact impact areas, which is very big. Goes all the way down to the knees, and it's underneath this mesh. This specific uh, Kevlar is made uh, made up with like two percent lycra. Lycra. I'm not quite sure uh, exactly. You know, it says it gives it more uh, more breathability as opposed to uh, you know the standard we currently have, and it gives the same protection but gives you more breathability and it's a cooler during the summer. So uh, improved, improved Kevlar in the impact zones. Hip protectors. They have different places where you can, like different Velcro positionings uh, where you can put the knee pads and uh, locate them, so. That's it, second one, I'll do the other side. Now let's try them on. You wanna see that probably, huh? No, no, 
So here you go. 33. Either 32 is slightly too tight, 34 is slightly too big. I'm a belt guy. These I took 34 waist and they fit me nice. Uh, the design is slim, as you see. And if, let's say, if I take the belt off, it's gonna slightly, uh, they're gonna fall slightly on me. 32 will be snug, so. But all in all, they look pretty cool, actually. Very, very nice, very comfortable. It's stretched, so it's, it's not heavy, it's not heavy denim. Pretty cool, actually. So, uh, I don't know, very nice. Let me put, let me go put my flannel on and check. I put the Beyond Riders flannel on. They're pretty cool. I'll take it outside. What's up? Okay, now let me read. See, I'm no, I'm no uh, fashion guy. I just, I just read. I'm reading you what he just. All our pants have double stitches. The outer layer stretchable four ways denim, 98% cotton, 2% lycra. The inner protective lining is 50% Kevlar and a mix of 50% Coolmax. Same protection level, but a more like more breathability. Three front pockets and two rear pockets. High quality front brand button. Premium quality original YKK zipper. What the heck is a YKK zipper? Patent is that a. A design, I don't know, but I, uh, what can, YKK zipper. Two reflective wide inner straps, I think I showed you before. Coated with trademarks, okay, whatever. So I decided to take them with me to India. And in India, I had a great time with my daughters. We rented some scooters and we took them through the rough conditions. You know, so we're, at, we're at the, we just uh, just rented uh, scooters. We're gonna tour the area. I thought it would be a great, a great idea actually. We got, uh, you know, from Beyond Riders. They were really excited and they were really pleased with my review and your response from it and everything. So they decided to send me uh, riding jeans, riding pants, and I'll just just try them out, you know what? And just tell us how, how you like them. And I said, you know what? I was uh, on my way to this trip in India. I said it would be a great, great opportunity to take it through the most rugged conditions, like literally. You know how India is really rough and, and the, the roads and streets. So all my rides over here are going to do with the, those pants. And these are the pants. For me. It's really warm. It's like 95 degrees right now. Everybody here rides in flip-flops and shorts. But, uh, you know, I prefer to go protective. Listen, guys, I have... Using the horn over here, it, the beep is not... An Ooh. It's not just a recommendation, it's wild. It's just like it's brought on the brakes, you have the, you have the beep, you have the hole. That you're coming behind him, in front of you, all around you. I hit the horn like every two. Every, wait a second. <laughs> Every two seconds, literally every two seconds, you hit the horn. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. <laughs> Oops, look. Oh, shit. You're trying to kill me. Okay. <laughs> I'm like, we rode with the worst conditions possible. Everything is low. It's like 95 degrees out. It's beautiful, but it's hot. And the jeans are, the, the pants are actually not terrible. I'm not sweating in them. So, my balls are not sweating. Let's put it that way. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that was our trip in India. And also, I went on a ride, a full day ride with my friend. He gave me his uh, Iron 883, Harley Iron 883. And we rode that bike all over the. Beyond Riders, Beyond Riders uh, Kevlar pants, which are, with all the seat, they're actually keeping me very, 
not not too hot, so it's like nice and airy. They're, uh, you know, I've been wearing them every time on a motor. I'm on a motorcycle here. I've been wearing them, and they're really doing a uh, doing a great job. Well, I didn't fall, thank God. But in terms of comfort, not not sweating in them, it's perfect. So we're gonna stop and eat over here. Obviously, in the last two months, I've been riding with the Beyond Riders pants locally as well in uh, the cold conditions. I can tell you one thing for sure at the bike. I can tell you one thing for sure is that the pants are, I would say, warm weather uh, pants. In cold weather, because they're so breathable, you definitely need another layer beneath them. I use it. I use the heated gear by Gerbing which is a lifesaver, but I also use, but also when I wear my normal everyday jeans, I, uh, in the winter, I use my heated gear as well. So that's no different. So let me sum up what I think about these riding pants. They're very, very light brand, uh, very light riding pants, very breathable, great for uh, warm weather conditions. I expect they're also very strong. Well, the outer coat, the outer material is a denim, some kind of a jeans, and internally it's Kevlar. Very strong and durable, but that will only know long term. So I think these pants would be great during uh, warm weather conditions. And in uh, cold weather, it's pretty much just like any other jeans. You want to have uh, an under layer, uh, long, long underwear, or just heated gear as well. As I've said in the video itself, the material itself has got a stretch to it. So the waist doesn't hold uh, the weight of the pads. So these pants are definitely, uh, you need to have belt with them. Otherwise they're gonna sag completely. It's not like uh, normal jeans that are not stretchable that you can wear them without, without a belt. So a belt is a must over here in this case. Things that I will not, not crazy about is the fact that it's stretchable, so the pants don't hold by themselves. I usually like to go without a belt, but that's that's the feature of the of these pants. It's you want to have them uh, flexible to be able to move and to be able you know to breathe, and so that's part of the features for them to be uh, made of a stretch material. The second thing is the pads being heavy pads with the weight of the Kevlar. The hands are heavy. The pants. <laughs> The pants are heavy. You have to wear a belt to hold them in place. But maybe it's actually the selection of the sizing that I took. I'm anywhere between a 32 and 34. Usually I wear a 33 and uh, Beyond Riders only makes 32 and 34. I went for the 34 and that was a little bit too big for me. So I have to wear a belt. Hopefully they come out with mid sizes like a 33 and then it solves all, you know, guesswork. And one last uh, important thing is they came in black. I am not a black jeans guy. I love blue jeans, so I actually spoke with them and requested some some blue jeans, see how that works. So, hey guys, there's also another announcement. Cycle Fanatics is having a meet and greet on the 29th of April, and I'm gonna be there, and I know a few other YouTubers are gonna be there. So come along, say hello to me, and to John, and to the rest of the YouTubers. It's gonna be at Bergen Harley Davidson here in Bergen County. So come and say hello to us. That's it, again, I'd like to thank Beyond Riders for providing this. I didn't say up till now, but if you like these jeans or the flannel that you've seen, go ahead to beyondriders.com, use Holy Shift code and you get a discount on your next purchase. So as I was just talking about April 29th, I just remembered that at the end of uh, April, we're gonna have the Advan Black Tour Pack giveaway. So if you did not take part and you wanna win this beautiful tour pack that I have on Grey Ghost, go ahead to uh, my website. Any item you purchase from the website gives you automatically, gives you automatically entries into that raffle. 
Hope you enjoyed this one, guys. I'm Sandy, watching Holy Shift. Till the next video, guys. Peace out. Bye.